What's going on everyone? Active Sin here and today we're talking about the GDC 2018 survey. Now the GDC is the Game Developers Conference. It's 4,000 developers that take this survey and it's to tell you who they're making games or what consoles and who has interest in it. So for the Nintendo Switch 2017, last year when the Switch first launched, 3% of these developers were currently making games for the Nintendo Switch. It was still a new device, nobody knew if it was going to be successful, but then again, we all really do, come on. But fast forward, 2018, and how many of these developers are currently making game? 12%. That is a four times increase in people developing for the Nintendo Switch in one year. That's really impressive. And even more impressive, 36% of these developers are interested in making a game for the Switch. They're not currently making it, but they are interested in making it. And why is that important? Because the PlayStation 4 is at 39%. So the Switch is right there with the PS4. And then the Xbox One is at 28%, so it's a little bit lower. But the Switch, huge interest in the device. And the reason for that is, the games are selling really well in this same survey. 28% of them say, who have put games on the Switch, that those games have sold better on the Switch than competing platforms. And that's with the install base of the Switch around 15 million. We're talking about PS4 over 70 million, Xbox One around 40 million, but yet 28% of those people, their games are selling better on the Switch. Incredible. This thing, home run by Nintendo. We knew it from jump that it was gonna be good because why? Nintendo is merging their strongest division, their handheld division, into their home console division, into one device that fits everybody's lifestyle. You can play this at home, you can play this on the go, it doesn't matter, the Switch is there for you. This thing is amazing and developers are taking notice and but most importantly people are buying it and they're buying the games and that is why we're getting continued support especially with indie developers but as well as triple a games that is great to see it is a very stark contrast from the wii u guys this same survey during the wii u generation one percent of developers were making games for the wii u and about the same we're interested in making games for the Wii U. So you can see, compared to Wii U generation, the Switch night and day difference, guys. That's why this is so important to talk about, because you can see the continued growth of the Switch. It is selling like crazy, fastest selling console in US history. It's also the fastest selling console here in Canada, ever. And some other countries as well, I believe. It's breaking records constantly and we just found out today, it's outsold the lifetime sales of the Xbox One in Spain. This thing's not even been out a year yet. It's crazy. The momentum of the Switch is unstoppable seemingly. And game developers are making games and we're all buying them and we're having fun. So I thought we would just talk about that. Let me know guys, what do you think about that? The Switch, killing it, gangbusters. Switch gang, making lots of money. <laughs> well, not we're not making money, we're spending money. <laughs> but yeah, a lot of games on the way for the Switch and it is just a good time to be a Nintendo fan yet again. Let's talk about it in the comment section, but uh, make sure to like this video, share, subscribe if you've not done so already, and have a great day and I will talk to you next time. Bye. This is gonna break. This phone is gonna break.